I'm not sad. I'm not sad. I think the friendship kind of came to an end. And I, I think everybody will see it and they'll understand why I'm not sad. She did give hope for the future, but it seems like there might not be hope on your part. I know about that. There was a trust that got broken, and I don't know that that's so easily repaired. I feel sad about it. I think it's sad, but I think um, it's weird. Um, aren't you? It's shocking. Yeah, I, it's, it's sort of very surprising. But I, I'm like not, very. I am going to tell you I'm not taking responsibility for it. Normally I would. I would take responsibility for something like that. But I feel um, maybe she didn't love me as much as I thought she did. Are we going to get back? Isn't that weird? That's heartbreaking, That, that, that is very heartbreaking. Yes. Can, is there a potential of getting to a better place with her? Do you think it's done for good? Um, you know, I what you see on the face of me is what you get. I am never going to say something I don't really mean. I don't know. I don't know if that's what it is with her because I always thought we were close. But she said to me that, you know, I thought wrong. It all boils down to the book. That's the that's the hearsay. You know um, not for me. Listen, I. That might have been the match for the Tinder. That would. You know what? Not for me because it's like. I championed her for that book. I wanted her book to be successful. I had my own book, with Simon Schuster, did unbelievably well, um, and I want only good things for her. I want good things for everybody, even if I don't love them. Yeah. I want good things for people. Do you know what I'm saying? It's like I support women unconditionally. Um, no one gets anywhere on their own. This is a team. I have a beautiful team behind me. I couldn't be me without everybody behind me. Um, I think she got very offended when I said I championed you. Um, and that didn't mean anything behind it. And uh, I think she was very offended that I said that. I think that sometimes people feel like they need to ruffle feathers to make a splash. And it's unfortunate. Like, you need to stay authentic to your true self. And I think um, she's looking for rumblings, trying to throw things out there and seeing if they stick. And I just, God bless.